How do you think about your role as a leader? Your mindset matters. And there's a predictable journey that many of us as leaders have, have walked throughout our career. We begin as doers, which makes sense because we were probably a doer before we were a leader and we did whatever we were doing well, someone noticed and asked us to step into leadership. The problem, the challenge, is that we begin our leadership journey as a doer. And that's a dead end street. And it doesn't take us long to figure that out for, for most leaders. That's when we discover delegation. And it's like a miracle. We discover that we can get work done through others. The fundamental problem with delegation, though, is that you and I are required to be in that process. We have to be in the work. We're the ones doing the delegating. So many leaders will take one more step and they'll become developers. And that's when our focus really shifts from the task to the people. And we develop those around us so that they can see what needs to be done and take appropriate action without our direct involvement. And that's a great place to be. But there's one more step. At some point, many leaders understand that they can become a designer and they can design the systems. They can focus more on culture. They can focus on leadership development, the systems and processes that will sustain uh, whatever it is they've created over the long haul. It's a dynamic relationship. Depending on your circumstances, you may have to move from one of those to another. But the trick is to always move forward and not get stuck.